Can't forget the chili. That goes so well. How's it going everyone? Hope you're having an amazing day. Welcome to the Foodie TV. It's Davian and Richard. And today we're in Fullerton, California visiting Ensenada's Surf and Turf Grill. They opened their first location back in 2014 in the city of Lawndale and has since grown to six locations. And today we're here in this particular location because it's in the heart of Orange County. Richard. Yes, Davian. Can you tell the audience what we're having today? All right, guys, today we're going to be trying Ensenada and Baja style fish and shrimp tacos. And it's going to be coming up in this video. Let's go. Guys, look at how humongous these tacos are. These are huge. They're even bigger than the size of my hand. These tacos look so delicious and there's just a mountain of things on here. We got fish, shrimp, cabbage, tomato, tartar sauce. Over here, over here we got the ensenada style, but they're ensenada style, so it's a surf and turf. We got some steak, we got, and then we got deep fried battered fish on corn tortillas. This one's flour tortilla, the Baja style. So there's the difference between the two. Yes. And then of course, we can't forget the ceviche. So this is a new ceviche that they have. It's a mango shrimp ceviche. Had to try it because it's the new item. Wow. That's a lot of ceviche. <laughs> it is. Wow. It is. But then there's also a lot of, this is a very fat taco with two tostadas. Wow. Okay. All right, Richard. You're the expert here. Okay. Where should we start? So I've been eating at this place for quite some time now. And when I want fish taco with the best crunch on them, like the batter to be always crunchy, because sometimes I eat fish tacos and once I put all that topping on there, it gets soft. Not at this place. At Ensenada Surf and Turf, it stays crispy. So let's start with the, my all-time favorite, the Baja tacos. Okay, let's do that. So here we go. Go ahead oh, and grab man. your taco. Dude, these things are huge. So like David said, the Baja taco comes with Frit, fish, shrimp, flour tortilla. It's a little different from the Ensenada tacos, which comes with corn tortilla. So. Oh, look at that, guys. Interesting. It's freaking massive. That is so hard to hold. Oh, and I can I can feel the how crispy the batter is already. Check that out, guys. Oh, That's man. Amazing. All right, so pro tip, you guys, they don't leave the sauce out. So there's this creamy sauce that comes with, uh, that goes really good with the fish tacos. And this is their red hot salsa, also very good. All right. Another pro tip is these chilies, do not pass up on these. They are uh, marinated with some type of seasoning and it's so good. It's not super spicy, but very flavorful. So definitely get those, you Always guys. have to have the chili with your tacos. They leave these out, so you guys have access to go grab as many as you guys want. If you guys really like it, go back and grab more. Holy crap, these are so big, I don't even know where to start. Okay, so first things first, seafood always needs that lemon on it. Just so a little bit, let's put this on. Get that zest on there. And then we'll try it without all the sauces on there. And then after, our, for our second bite, we'll put the sauces on. Oh, this is gonna be a mouthful. Check that out. Super, super big tacos. All right, so let's go Baja Tacos. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Mm. It's just like how I always remember it. So consistent with the crispy batter on the fish and shrimp. That was amazing. Got I like how light the batter is. Yeah. Well, can't forget the chili. That goes so well with the tacos, you guys. That is amazing. So, what do you think? It's incredible. <laughs> Super fresh. Batter's light and crispy. Mm -hmm. Oh, the shrimp adds a different texture. Yeah. Along with the fish. Yeah. Ooh, it's the chili. It's that, it's that chili just throws like a whole nother level of flavor in there. I'm getting a kick on that after yeah. taste. It's like, so if you bite into the seeds, no. there's definitely a kick in there, but if you just bite the tip, it's super good. Wow. Very refreshing. All right, I'm ready for my second bite. You are? Okay, just like, let's throw some salsa on it. Red salsa. Salsa. And let's throw a little bit of this creamy salsa on it. I'm just gonna stay with the red salsa. So, oh, snack in mind. Again. Look, these are huge. There All you right. go. Here we go. Cheers. Bite. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
forget about this. Oh wow. <laughs> Chase it with the chili. It may look a little overwhelming and intense, but that batter that they have on it is so light and crispy. It's like biting into a, a fluff of air and cloud, and then you have the soft fish that's perfectly cooked and it's not like tough or overcooked, I should say. And the shrimp, shrimp and fish is very easy to overcook. Yeah, it's cooked but perfectly. They timed this all right where they can get the batter to be super crispy, light, and then the fish and the uh, shrimp to be very tender and like, kind of fluffy in there, like flakes off very easily. Yeah, and it doesn't feel heavy at all. Like, I could literally finish this taco in seconds. Oh yeah. And that tartar sauce that they put on it, usually tartar sauce can be a little bit overwhelming, but this one is just right. It's very light, subtle, and it complements the fish uh, and shrimp tacos very well. Yeah, mm. delicious. I like that a lot. And uh, the cabbages adds a nice light crunch, it, it does. crunch to nice, it too. Nice little freshness to it. Yeah. All right. Okay, so let's move on to, move on the, to the surf and turf. Surf and turf. This one's a little different. So you guys, so you guys saw the uh, Baja tacos came with flour tortilla, and then the. Ensenada comes with a corn tortilla, so you see that's a yellow tortilla and versus the white flour tortilla from the Baja. You got the double tortilla here, all right? Standard double tortilla. Look at that carne asada that's on it, the fried fish. You got your cabbage, tomato oh. salsa, and the tartar sauce. Oh on man, it. the weight on this is heavy. Oh wow, this is easily a pound, <laughs> right? Man. Okay, so let's try this just as is. Okay. You I don't know where to start. Cheers. Go. Cheers. Mm. 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 Oh wow. Whoa. I was not expecting that. I was not. Yeah. The meat is flavorful. Flavorful. Juicy. Pairs well with the fish. Has a nice bite to it where and complements the fish with the crunch on it. That crunch actually gives it such a like fun texture with the steak. Amazing. The, and the corn tortilla is just nice and soft. It's, it's still warm. It's so fresh. I feel like this is corn tortilla that they made here. It tastes like it. It tastes like it's house-made tortilla, not like the stuff you buy in stores. It's like completely different. Just what you would expect from a good corn tortilla. Right, and just the color of it too. You don't see this type of yellow corn tortilla unless you're actually mashing up corn and then making it out of that corn flour for themselves, yeah, right? <laughs> so, Richard, you, you came here a lot back in the day, right? Back in the days, I would be posting this all the time and I would always get people flooding into my DMs asking me where is that place? And of course, you guys know, I gotta share it oh. because you guys gotta experience this. This is I so amazing. I forgot the lime on the last oh one. Oh my gosh, you shoot, oh you know what? You're gosh. right. Sorry guys. Rookie mistakes. Don't, uh, <laughs> don't hate me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this time we got the lime. Okay. Got Jesus. everything. Got the salsa on there. All right, let's go back for another bite. Let's go. Amir, get Amir on there. That completes it. Lime, salsa, okay, forget the pepper too, and the chili. Mm. That's where it gets hot right there. You bite into that sleeve, you're done. Oh, we can't forget these onions right here, pickled onions. So these are pickled onions with um, their <laughs> seasoning on there, and they put it with jalapenos. So these these onions are actually a little bit spicy. So once you bite into there, be prepared for a little kick to it. I already have a kick in my mouth. <laughs> Cheers. Yeah, that's spicy. <laughs> good. Amazing, amazing tacos, you guys. Like I said, if I ever crave the crispy fish tacos, this is where I go. And I always, always order the Baja taco. That's my main staple here. I always get the Baja tacos, and they come in two styles. They come in grilled or breaded. Always right. go for the breaded. That's yeah. where it's at, you guys. But if you want to stay a little tiny bit healthier, the grilled option is available for you. So just get two, one grilled and one breaded. So that yeah. way you get both the best worlds, you guys. All about balance. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's use these plates now because this is kind of full. I definitely want to continue eating this, but we still have the star. The, the ceviche. ceviche. I'm going to use this plate. Crack this piece right here. Oh, that was a pro move, man. 
stuff just to all let right. you guys see the amazing uh, ceviche that's on here. They stack it all on here. So if you guys just want to pick this up and eat it, super easy to do. You got mango, shrimp, and avocado. Tomatoes. Tomatoes. Of course, the lemon juice. Oh, yes. Or lime juice. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's take a couple. Got to get a little bit of everything, right? Oh. And there's the VK bar. You can see it right in the front. And you can see them. They're preparing that right in front of you. Scooping all the ceviche. Yeah, they're not hiding anything on there. You gotta see everything fresh to order. Without salsa? Or no? Without salsa. Okay. We gotta get that base first. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Mm. Fresh. That is addicting. That's really good. That is really good. <clears throat> it's fresh, it's bright. It's tangy. Not, yeah, but it's not too tangy. There's some ceviches where I eat where the lime just overpowers the shrimp. Mm -hmm. And all I'm eating at that point is very sour shrimp, which I enjoy sometimes, but this had a nice balance of flavor. Yes. The creamy from the avocado, the sweetness from the mango, and the ceviche that's just perfectly limed. Mm -hmm. That was amazing. And then the acidity from the tomatoes as well. Perfect. It's not like one of those mushy tomatoes either. It's not like they use fresh tomatoes to make this which is very important. All right. So you guys know, if you're eating ceviche, you always got to have the tapatio. So let's go and uh, try it with tapatio right. now, you guys. This is like the all-star of hot sauce for ceviche right here. Let's scoop a little bit on. Oh man, this ceviche is amazing. Funny. Yeah, if you guys never know what Ensenada is all about, they're they're well known for their seafood, you guys. Like, right. it, you can't go wrong with anything from Ensenada I'm when going, it comes to seafood. I'm going to put just a little bit of tapatio. <laughs> That's more than a little, Damien. <laughs> <laughs> if it doesn't hurt, it's not enough. That's my model. <laughs> nice. Okay, cheers, cheers you guys. Mm. The tapatio is kicking me right now, but at the same time, it's so enjoyable. Super good. Wow, that's really good. That's really, really, really good. Right when I bite into this ceviche, it's so fresh. It feels like it just came right from the ocean. I don't think it gets any better than this. I don't think so either. I feel like they go through so much ceviche here throughout the day that it's not, nothing's left over to sit around and you're getting a fresh batch all the time. That's what it tastes like to me. You know? Yeah. And, so, and so I was looking around at all the customers in here. They either order just the fish taco or just the ceviche. Yeah. Or the hungry ones, they order both. Yeah. So they did basically what we did today. <laughs> you can't go wrong, guys. All right, last bite. Cheers. This feels like you can't get full off of it. It's so yeah, refreshing yeah. where super light. You eat it and then you're gonna have another bite. You think about taking another bite and then you do it and then it just keeps repeating. Yeah. Every time you think you wanna stop, your hand just starts moving towards it and starts making another one and then you eat it. <laughs> that was super good. All right, that was great. Richard, you know what time it is. What time is it, man? Which one was your favorite? Like I said, every time I come here, the Baja Tacos is my favorite because you get the best of both worlds. You get the shrimp and you get the fish, but the Ensenada Tacos were new to me. I've never tried that, so that was really good. That's something I definitely will get again. Yeah. Didn't think that combo would be good, but man, it, it matched really good. Right, so what was your favorite? I'm torn between the ceviche and the OG Baja style, Baja style tacos. fish tacos. You can't go wrong with those. Yeah. because the the flour tortilla is not your typical flour tortilla that you find in stores. Yeah. This one is a lot thinner. Yeah. It reminds me of the flour tortillas you find in TJ. Um, that, but that speaks a lot. I, I always like to stay on the lighter side, so yeah. I would go for the ceviche. ceviche. So there you go, you guys. If you guys are coming, order my favorite, which is the Baja Tacos, or you can get David's favorite, which is the ceviche. You won't go wrong with any of those. And even the Ensenada Tacos was a 10 out of 10. That was definitely a hit, you guys. Amazing. All right, guys. Too good. If you guys enjoyed this review today, please hit that like button. If you guys have any other recommendations of other places we need to try, put it in the comments below. And we'll see you guys on the next episode of My Foodie TV. TV. See you guys. Peace.